Welcome back guys to Archive Gaming. So let's continue our you want to playthrough here. Um so where we were the last time where we left off. You know, I was looking at this and I'm kind of split between two forces. I was just thinking about it, like boy, I'm getting drawn more and more out in two different directions. And I swear that was not my original intention, but I've got the numbers for it right now. You know, I've got this nice little pipeline coming from down here. And as long as this remains, you know, undisrupted, I can kind of keep going back and forth with these guys. So, you know, I can just keep trading punches with them. And sooner or later, I'll deal a knockout blow, you know. And as long as my pipeline isn't disrupted, then I'll, I can just keep doing that. Uh, the only thing I'm really having trouble with is I'm hemorrhaging a lot of gold with my officer loyalties, but if you've ever played with Duan Chu, you know that that's... Those are the beats when you play as Yuan Chu. It's just extremely unlikable. Okay, so we're going to try to catch Men Kong in a pincer here. And I don't know what these guys are doing. I, we can't see their orders. Although, a nice little tip I'm sure you guys have noticed is that sometimes the enemy officers will blurt out who their target is. So you'll get to see. Because they'll have a little speech bubble and they'll say, we're going after so-and-so. And that'll give the game up where you don't have to actually know and figure it out. But not all of them do that. It looks like he's going for fooling, which is weird. Oh boy. Alright, Jiling's ready to deploy Godly Trident. We're going to need to save that for Guan Yu. This is what I was worried about, was getting drawn in. Getting a little too clever. And this is what happens when you get a little bit too clever. Now I did start moving him over to support, but I was thinking that was going to be at least another turn away. Alright, let's hit Guan Yu before he hits us. Now if we can knock him out, the path to uh, Liu Bei's last city might open itself up finally. Not bad. Why did a fire start? The surprise attack start a fire? We didn't manage to capture Guan Yu. That would have been nice. Okay, let's see. Applies disorder. Doesn't apply fire. Maybe something he did. Fire attacker. Oh, he lit the whole forest up. I know there's a way to tab over from there. How do I tab over? Oh boy. Maybe not. Okay. Maybe you have to go this way. I could have sworn there was a way to tab over right from there. Fire attacker. Fire attacks will succeed. Ignite. So I'm assuming he has that equipped right now. Fire arrows, okay. Wow, so fire arrows covers a whole area. He's gonna have to hold there. Oh, 
We need to take out Liu Bei while we can. Guajia could certainly help us with some um, with his goose formation. Okay, let's give him a promotion. We'll send him out. Seven thousand. Oh, uh, yeah, that's a. I'd like to go eight, honestly. But we're gonna need those openings if we're able to take Liu Bei. I don't want to jump the gun here, but if we are able to take out Liu Bei and absorb his force, then we'll need those titles. Catapult, but oh, 25 leadership. Okay, divide I. When units of your force other than your own are afflicted with ailments, the period is shortened. Okay. Maneuver goes up, which is amazing. Dash. You know, we've seen Jiao Yuan do it. Even his wagons are fast as hell. Doesn't care about traps. He doesn't care about false information. Uh, they're not the best traits. I wonder what Gorgia's traits were in, in the base game before the uh, false information and, and the... Uh, well, false information would be the only one. I guess he might have had this armor before. Okay, I feel like we want Inferno. Um... Morale, not assault. Okay. Okay, let's send him down here. We'll try to make a go for uh, CRP. I don't know if it's enough or not. I'm going to keep him there. If he breaks off, he breaks off. But I don't want to change his orders up. We've got our bandit up on the mountain. Got to stick to that theme. Got another 7,000. Man, he's... Luckily for us, it's... We're avoiding, like, his best generals right now. Um, South South, that is. Been very fortunate. Let's do that. More banquets, of course. I've been draining just a lot of resources into that. I really don't know if there's a way around it as you want to. I just feel like you're just so unliked. Okay. We're doing a pretty good job here. Raising troops, everything. Like I said, it's not. I don't think this area here is going to be threatened. I'm assuming this is pretty much a valid strategy for any force. If anybody's done a run with uh, Yang Bayu, I'd like to know. <laughs> Does it play out like that? Do you just take this little conquer area and then create a pipeline? So I feel like that's the ideal way to do it. It's another one I haven't tried. There's so many. There's so many forces that I'd like to get around to trying in this game. Nah, I think we'll I think we'll just leave that be. Let's just search, get back to it. Okay. Uh there we go. Can sort of get both here, a view of both. Well, I don't think that ring's gonna do much, honestly. I guess we'll focus up here. Another 1700. Uh, hopefully, that's not Zhang Fei. <sighs> of course, it is. Who else? 
Is he gonna wedge himself in between? <laughs> of course. Oh Lord. Thankfully, Liu Bei doesn't have that many troops. He's got to get out of range. I don't even know if I want to use him for anything else. 3,000 is very, very low. Um, hmm. You know what can we do with that? I don't I don't know. It's not gonna be enough to assault the castle. What I'd like to do what I'd really like to do is call up Yuan Chu himself and have him participate on the attack. But uh due to poor planning we don't have our troops in position. I should have had these guys up there already. That's what separates the really good players from the really bad players, right? The really good players are already, they're not one or two steps ahead. They're three, four, five steps ahead. They have, and they have their contingencies all over the place. Average players, we can, I can go one to two steps, but I can't go three to four. That's too much. Everything starts to get muddled. Okay, this guy started to move up. Looks like it's a fake out. He's drawing already. We're gonna stay here. We want to fight under the tower. And so let's make Hiji start to move closer to the mountain. Is he reckless? Ambitious, not reckless. Okay. So you'll follow orders at least. Yeah, I think it's time. Let's let's move Yonchu up. He needs to lead from the. Uh, he needs to be leading from the front anyway. Time to get back on the saddle. He I used him a lot in my central showdowns against Cao Cao earlier, but he got crushed. Wow, it looks like Sun Jian's going all in to finish off Liu Biao. Okay. Events? No, no events. Suggestions. It's gonna be 700, but we are leaving the spot so we can use it. You can use some cash from here. Okay, barracks and Luigi. I guess we could do that. It'd be nice to be able to invade here, but we don't have the ship tech to cross these rapids, so we'd have to go all the way around and even bluffing becomes a chore, you know? Okay, we're gonna keep him there for a while still. Drive that order all the way down. And back, he's gonna encroach. Well, I think he's just gonna... Maybe just wait in the wings. Maybe he can attack... Um... Oops. Maybe he can attack at the end. But I really don't know what else to do with him. Inferno, that seems a bit excessive, but okay. 
Alright, there goes my Kong. He stood back on the fire. <laughs> I couldn't have known that would be there. Soon Jian's becoming a real pain in the ass. A real pain in the ass. With his demands. Why don't we trade? What does he want? The, uh... The next area? I'll trade you for it. Maybe at the end of this alliance we should be in position. I said two years, so it'd be 199. Yeah, I don't understand this AI. Um, it seems, it's honestly really dumb. They start advancing and then they withdraw. I don't know what the bug is behind it or if there's a, I don't know what, what it is, but I do know that it, it does hurt me in the sense that it puts its strain on supplies. But I can't just have a lot of units sitting around. Okay. I'm waiting for Gorge. Yeah, he's going to be there. One more turn. One more turn away, we'll be able to just assault Xiaopi. <laughs> can't pull these guys because he's in... Okay, let's advance. We'll come out from undercover. Let's get our snake guy in the woods. That's where he gets his bonus. And then from there, we'll go straight over there. Okay, two hexes. One, two. He's there. I do believe that'll be there. Okay. You want shoes here already? Great. Transports nowhere. <laughs> nowhere near. And again, I do want to bring out another unit, but I can't because if Salsa wants to, he can concentrate right now and and completely push me back and blow me out. And we'd be caught with nothing here to defend Guanling. And then we'd be stranded. That would be a total nightmare. Now we're heading to 198, so might get some new officers. Treat units. Treat units? Have them heal their wounded is a splendid idea. Oh, I've never seen this before. So he can heal individual troops. It's a fucking miracle worker. Can't actually see the, uh, the wounded. Wow, that's very cool. I'm very curious to see how much he gets. One more turn away, we'll try to assault the city. This runs its own risk that if we're not able to take it, then it's going to be South South City. I won't be able to dispute it either, so... Wow, 1,600. Alright, everybody's in position. Kong Zun Jang has been released by Yuan Chao. That's not believable, but okay. Kong Zun Jiang's attack failed. Wow. All those troops and it was not enough. 
You know, now his kinsman's moving in. Maybe if he takes the port, right? If he doesn't take the port, he's gonna suffer a, a Kung Rong. The fate of Kung Rong. Okay. How's Liu Biao doing? Is he finished? Yeah, it looks desperate. The only hope is that that march should be kind of slow over the mountains. Didn't deploy Wei Yan. Oh, Wei Yan switched sides. That's right. I forgot. Yeah, it doesn't look good for him. He might so he might still hold out, but all right, he's gonna take that. At least he should. Let's turn back around. Okay, new officer. Oh no, come on. That guy was a recruiter. Set free. The two, the truth will set you free. That's what Yuan Shao said, and that's that he had nothing to do with his brother's murder. <laughs> had nothing to do with it. The Battle of Jing. Uh, this is the one that wipes out Yuan uh, Gong Zun Jiang. If we wanted to be shrewd, we could do it just to just to wipe out, uh, just to get Zhao Yun to join Liu Bei, and then and then by extension maybe be able to recruit Zhao Zhao Yun um, if we take the city, which it looks improbable to me, honestly. But I have no intention of doing that. All right, Gorgia. Cool. Yeah, hopefully, you don't. Your unit doesn't melt immediately. Oh, it's taking a minute to cross that forest. Wow, where is this unit coming from? Good lord! Sao Tsao is not afraid of sending his guy two cities away. He'll send the unit from back here. All the way across. <laughs> Which I guess in central China it kind of makes sense because looking at this map you can see all the roads poking through. And it's all roads pretty much. So maybe that's what it is. I think if we're gonna take out Liu Bei we're gonna have to we're gonna have to send you on Chu out. Make way for the Emperor. Totally legitimate Emperor. I feel like you should have a free agenda slot for your main uh, guy. If you're playing as, like me, I'm playing as you want you, I should be able to just have personal control over him. He shouldn't take up an agenda slot, and I should be able to, uh, should be able to give him, use his tactics and stuff. And he should be able to train. You know, borrow a little bit from your RPG, ROTKs. Not a lot. You know, not a lot. Don't bog it down because I... I like my, uh... My Warlord ones. But, you know, maybe let me train a little bit so that I can get my stats up over time. Because the way the XP is doled out in the system is... And this one is not very good. I think even 11 did it better in terms of XP and certainly 9 and 9 if you worked at it you could get your off you could take a rubbish officer and make something out of them in time okay I don't know if we want to engage this guy anymore I think we're gonna we're gonna drop back okay 
Because I'm gonna march out you on you, so now it's like You know, I could be in trouble here if I didn't play my cards right, but we have a transport on the way, but crossing the ocean right now, it could be a while. Let's check our suggestions. We have nothing but banquets. Every hour is happy hour. When you have the pockets of the Yuan family. It's not even on the water yet. It's not even on the water yet, guys. This is a real gamble. This city's be, this city's gonna be left for four thousand. So I'm not gonna be surprised if Yuan Chao's. I mean, Yuan Chao. South Chao's like now's the time. Now we fucking attack for real. All right, we're gonna withdraw back a bit. Okay, rally. I think increases assault. We have to do that early. Gorgi has already lost 3,000, so he's not going to be there next turn. So you can see here, like a hungry wolf, he's watching. I think it's mo most definitely just going to be his gain, honestly. Oh, yeah. oh. Let me just have him, let's just have him retreat. We're not, we're not really going to fight for it if we don't have to. If we can keep him marching around wasting his time, we'll do that. Oh boy. That's a sledgehammer. Okay, let's check our suggestions. We might have a reinforced unit somewhere. No, nothing. More banquets, more parties. Alright, that's it. Train, let's do that. That's about it, really. Oh man, hopefully we get the city because we I really need Liu Bei's power to help me fight Cao Cao. I need that influx of, of officers, even if it's just like if it's not even not even the three brothers, but all his other guys. Wow, Guan Yu, he's gonna really do some damage. Okay. It's a bit awkward. Oh, look at my volley guy. Leadership, alright. Okay, Zhu Huan looks like he's he's earnest. Getting pretty close here. Okay, we don't want to do any of those. He's injured. We're not gonna we're not gonna fire him because he's injured. 
will be fine. It just needs a little time. Alright. I'm pretty much all in on this attack anyway at this point. I don't know what he's doing. I guess he's stuck. That's a really that must be a really slow march there attacking that last city. Let's just search. Really eager to see how this is going to play out. Well, if we're unable to take it and South South takes it instead, we're going to be in a world of hurt. Not immediately, but long term. If he seeks shelter with Cao Cao and discusses heroes like in the novel, I'm definitely going to be a rotten skeleton. A skeleton rotting in a closet. I'll have to agree with him. Come on, guys. gonna come down to Yuan Chu. <laughs> it's really gonna come down to Yuan Chu. Oh boy. Oh boy. He's coming for Guan Ling. The jig is up. He's finally seen through our ruse. Wow. Oh man. Okay, so if there was ever a point to be more vulnerable, it's like we've been exposed. You know? Touting myself the little conqueror, you know, I come over here, I start building up, oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna hold you off, I'm gonna invade Liu Bei, don't, don't fuck with me, you know, and now Cao Cao's like, okay, I knock, I call, I'm calling, I'm, I'm calling the bluff here, now I'm, I'm in danger of being exposed for the charlatan that I really am, a big phony, these guys get routed, the path is open, this is looks like it's gonna collapse too. So we might get completely wrecked. Oh shit. We can charge in and try to attack. I think the best option is gonna be to charge in and attack. Um so let's do that. So Ren outclasses us. Oh, we're gonna need your 3,000. We might actually. Let's get him here. Oh, this is a tough call. I don't know if he can build another fire trap really quickly. Off the road here on the side of Fuling. No, I can't. build one behind the tower okay okay so to build a fire trap or oh, but there's a good chance that he's gonna deploy even more I don't think sending him on a mission to try to cut off south south supply lines really gonna work I think it's too risky. You can easily just send another unit out and just there you go, fixed it. Let's build a camp. Can we build a camp back here? Okay. We'll do that. Just to slow down the advance. Although it is three units, you know what? Oh man, I am so exposed. It's like shining a light on a rat that's been hiding in the dark. He starts freaking out. He doesn't know where to go. Running in the walls and shit. <laughs> oh, boy. This could fail. Worst case, this fails. And this guy just busts right through. You know? And I'm running out of time. You know, Yuan Shu's not long for this world. I don't remember what I have the... Uh, I'm going to have to check what I have the life... If it's on standard, I think Yuan Xu's only got about a year left. 
Not to mention his officer corps, most of those guys don't live very long either, so... We need new blood. Okay, the thing is, if I move him in any direction, it could cause him to deploy more people. And right now, I can't handle any more. Got freaking Cao Cao. Himself. Transport's almost there. <sighs> Boy. I'm not worried about losing Guanling, but I am worried about losing all my progress. Okay, we're just gonna have to hope that they do some damage over there. Maybe Jilin can get one more rally off before he, uh, before he's routed. He's not gonna deploy again though, right? No, have to be crazy. Alright, try to engage while he's tied up there. Gift from Cheeks, yeah. Ooh, inflamed again. They're giving a good accounting of themselves. It's hard to overestimate just how OP Cao Cao is. <sighs> That's poor positioning. That's my fault. All my fault. Let's go, guys. You gotta get that. You gotta win that one. Be a great time to have a reinforce option right now. Just send an extra 3,000. That's all it would take to kind of get us over the hurdle over there. Look at our fares over here. Seventeen. What? Where's the siege weapon? Oh, it, siege weapon is still stuck. Still taking its time climbing over, yeah. That's that's his saving grace right there. The siege weapon's not able to come up, so he might actually hold off. As unlikely as it looks. Okay, he's almost finished, but... I don't think he'll be able to break off either. Restrain, let me see, what was that? Restrain who? Salon me. That could be interesting. Now if we lose our all our progress there, you know, that's fine. That's a great trade if we're able to at least take out Liu Bei. That's, you know, that's nothing. Okay, that might slow him down enough to the where I can get fall back to fooling. Oh, damn it. Is he withdrawing? He is. Wow, South Tsao recalled to his eastern front just to deal with me. Oh, 
Oh, did we take it or is that just damage? I think that's just damage. That's right, fight under the tower at this point. Great, here comes everybody else. As expected. Actually, I think we are going to take it, but we're going to need the march. Let's see if we have a treat from the doctor first before we move on. No, okay. We're going to need to reinforce the city right away because we might be attacked by South Cell. He might not give us time to kind of settle in. I know I wouldn't. Well, you have dash, so you should be fast. I'm assuming I'm going to get it here. It looks like it. So, I'm going to work on that assumption and start sending units up to defend it. So we don't lose our prisoners. Okay. Let's get somebody back from training here. He's training here. Let's get that off. Well, let's just move him there for now. Man, this is coming down to the wire. It's kind of a lot like, uh, I don't know if you guys have played the Nobunaga games, but it's a lot like the Nobunaga games. And it's kind of an irritating part in that, more so than this one, is that you can do a lot of work, but usually what happens is that you get in these spots where you're racing the computer. Because the computer tries to backdoor. You know, they try to cash in on all your work. And in the Nobunaga games, it's really irritating because you have to work really hard. I mean, in this game, it's it's not too bad. It doesn't feel as rough. But in those, it's a totally different story. It, it just feels very, very, very demoralizing because you have to do a lot more in those. We got him. Yes. We have eliminated the Matt Weaver. Craftsman trait, one of the coolest traits ever. So counterattacks from your bases is increased by 20%. And durability restored is increased by 20%. Okay, now let's see who we can who we can recruit Simahis here. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? Simayi, who if you're watching this if you guys have been catching the South Sea, you know that I've recently captured Simayi. Now I haven't I don't know if I recruited him yet or not. By the time I upload this one I'll probably know. But in this current timeline I don't know if he's going to join me over there as well. This will be interesting if he joins me here. Okay, well. How many did we get? Six officers. Wow, we got six right off the jump. Detain the rest. Yeah, that doesn't discourage him at all. See, he's still coming. He doesn't care. That's why we're bringing up more. Because we need to be able to fend off the city immediately. So 
while we while we gained the base forces, we've also gained another border next to South South, which just means more constant war. Now the true battle begins. Amazing item around Shapi. Okay. Okay, let's get our men there. Into the city, reinforce it immediately. Okay, so who joined us? Sao Bao? Oh. Well, his stats are actually much better than they used to be. 69 strength, I'm shocked. Xiao De, Jin Li, Jin Li, I think we had Jin Li already. Yan Yu, I think is new. Shen Kun, I think is new. He's new. I guess they'll be in the city, won't they? Okay, so who needs like a more pressing boost? I guess these two guys. Alright guys, it's time to start recruiting. We gotta start with the brothers, of course. Oh, yeah. I'm thinking we could take the weapons from them. If I was being real shrewd right now, that's what I would do. I would take the weapons first and then try to recruit them. Because if they don't I don't if you that way if you don't get them, they run away. You at least got a little consolation prize in terms of a, some weapons. Okay, now I know I have plenty of officers that have been just sitting around for for a while. I don't want to call up too many because once we recruit the base force, we'll be uh we'll be bloated in that city, but. See, can we do anything against Sawa and Ming? We can throw a party. Sounds, that sounds about right. Oh, poor delusional Yuan Shu. All these things are happening, and he's just like, ah, don't worry about it. Let's throw a party. Okay, do we send a replacement? Unit out there to patrol? I don't think so. I think we need to just leave it be for now. Nice route number, of course. Okay, now there's 10 there, so we can send out especially the wealth. Just under four turns, perfect. Okay, we have two more orders, let's try for uh... Semi Yi, sure. All these officers, and we're so vulnerable right now. Squidgia, still injured? He is, so his advice is not the most sound right now. You know, he's still got blurred vision, seeing double. He's probably wondering why he's working for the Yuan right now. Thankfully, I made that alliance with uh, Kong Rong a long time ago. Ah, uh, this doesn't surprise me. It's 
going to be like that for a while. That's why we've got to defend the city. Captured. We lost two officers, both turbans. Liao Hua. And now he Ji. Let's see if we can get our guys back. At least we got Huad first. Alright. Hope he's right. Well, let's start with Liu Bei. Wow, watch you himself, huh? Okay. Alright. Yuan Chu is going to go ahead and bury the hatchet with Liu Bei. Let's see if he can keep his arrogance and ego in check. These extra guys. Let's see Shang Ba. Really good officer. And broad orders. Fourteen thousand. Where are they going? Want you visited Liu Bei? Yeah. Okay. Understandable. There we go. Oh man. Sao Ba was porched by Sao Tsao. Oh, okay. I guess it's time to go. Time to go, go, go. This bandit operation is officially closed. Okay. Let's see if he can repair it for as long as he can. Oh, he's wasting his time there. Send out Yuan Xu and Jiling. Mm, I don't know if I should have been more specific. I might have. Hopefully, the AI knows to put one on each side, but. We've got to get one. We need to really badly. We need at least to get one of the brothers. Or even Semai Yi. Not the banquets.
Uh, if we're gonna stand against Southside, we're gonna need that power. Okay, hopefully he can get away. Is he reckless? He's not, so he will follow orders. Okay. Another 13,000. He's coming. He's furiously charging. We got Simayi. Great. That's a huge get. Is he going to stay loyal? That's a different question. That's a different matter entirely. Shang Shu's captured. Shang Ba, okay. Okay, now that yes, Liao Hua got out, he broke out. Oh no, that's not a good trade. Everyone stay in yourselves. I take it back. Everybody stay put. Oh, Guan Yu's out there. All right, guys. Well. That's going to be it for this one. Let's just reward Semai so he doesn't immediately declare himself independent. <laughs> so, uh, like I said, I'll be uploading this one. Um, we'll continue this one in between the South Sea. That's the plan for now. So you'll probably see uploads for the Yuan Shu campaign on Tuesday and Thursday. That's the plan for now. So if you guys are enjoying it, uh, please like and subscribe. Uh, give me a comment down below. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, we almost got exposed for being the frauds that we are. <laughs> but we managed, we've managed to save face so far. So, uh, yeah, we'll see you guys on the next video. Until then, take care.